a storm drain um, in an effort to be compliant with Santa Monica's goal to be carbon neutral in the coming years. Um, that means we're not taking our cars as much. Blue buses are free. Here's a shot of it coming. <laughs> and here we go. got off the bus and we're a few steps away from the Pico storm drain. Blue lines symbolize the watershed. So where is the water that's coming into the storm drain coming from? As we do our nature writing exercise today, remember what you're doing is you're taking some notes from the lived moment that we're in. But you're going to sculpt them into an essay that has some kind of a political message. But you don't want the political message to be divorced from the reality of the moment. sit down upon this beautiful beach, I can see the power of nature. You know, when you sit here and you look at this ocean and you realize over that horizon, I mean, it just, you know, the ocean really reminds you of how interconnected everything is. If I look at the horizontal line of the ocean, right to left, I feel like it's carved. And it, I feel like it's part of the earth and it's, I feel like part of the nature. with the snow like beautiful bubbles, singing with the smooth sound of cotton balls hitting the shore. Behind all this, I see the tops of mountains. It's kind of when someone in the crowd is trying to grab your attention, you can barely hear them and when you see them, you can see only the top half of their face and their arms waving. The top layer of the soil is crusty and it holds resistance, but when my new pressure is applied, it cracks. Beneath the layer lies a crust of loosely packed sand crumbling at the slightest touch, at my human touch. The old, the young, the worn, the green coming to worship this intrinsic force of nature. The weight of the world is on my shoulders. <laughs> 